we have a connection. Welcome. In this video I'm taking a look at Node MCU version 3 module board with ESP8266 microcontroller. ESP8266 is designed by Expressive Systems, located in Shanghai, Beer, China. It offers a Wi-Fi solution that can be used, for example, turning the lights on and off from a PC and smartphone or existing Wi-Fi connection, or collecting data from a bunch of different sensors connected to the module board. Basically, you can create cheap and decent home automation with the help of this board. I bought this module board on eBay for less than 3 bucks with a free shipping. I will put link in the description. This Node MCU comes with built-in micro USB connector with a voltage 3.3 volts powering the board and data transmission. There are 30 pins soldered on this board. 16 of them should be general purpose input output pins. By the rules of counting, I found that only 13 of them are being used. Reason? I don't know. If you know, feel free to comment. Most of those 13 GPIO pins are multiplexed with other functions, as you can see on this picture. Board contain only one analog input with 1024 step resolution. For all other pins that I didn't mention, take a closer look on this picture or check image link in description below. Processor is Tensilica L106 RISC with a 32-bit architecture running at 80 MHz. On the wiki side of ESP8266, I found that CPU and flash clock speeds can be doubled by overclocking on some devices. By doing that, CPU can be run at 160 MHz and flash can be sped up from 40 to 80 MHz. Flash memory capacity is 16 MB. There is 32 KB of instruction RAM plus 80 KB user data RAM present on this board. One blue LED is soldered near the antenna and there are two buttons surrounding micro USB connector. One for reset and another for flash. Wi-Fi module offers 2.4 GHz, 80211 BGN and up to 5 TCP connections simultaneously. And that's it. I'm planning to make some projects with this board, so expect more videos with NodeMCU in the future. I hope you found some new information in this video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it, and if you want to see more content like this, subscribe. Good luck!